what's up everybody welcome back to exotic us logi and i have been getting so many requests time and again from last two months and now finally i have got the time to make this video and i also have done my own research on this and yes today's topic is perhaps one of the most discussed topics in this planet right now is bitcoin for me is bitcoin for me is it the place where i should invest or will i get returns like the others have got all right or is my money going to go into thrash <laughs> like for some people it has happened or is it like the dot com bubble which bursted all right so today we will see as per astrology what positions of your horoscope can tell you that should you invest in bitcoin and to what extent to what extent you should not invest all right there you go if you are new to the channel and you have not yet subscribed then please subscribe to it my god in last one week 10 days so many people have subscribed i don't know how <laughs> miracle maybe and if you want a consultation then approach me in my website below and if you like this video click the thumbs up and if you want me to make any other videos like this bitcoin or some other videos which you people have been telling me second marriage third marriage bhav chale chart yes 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 i will be making them they are on the list all right and before beginning as i always say god is there with you all the time just look to him and you will find him in this bitcoin thing also <laughs> okay so basically i will not go into details of what bitcoin is cryptocurrency and all this you can google it if you don't know which is very unlikely because most of the people know what cryptocurrency is but nobody knows what actually it is because nobody knows <laughs> all right so i will not waste time by explaining what cryptocurrency is whatever it is even i don't know too much about it so now let's go to astrology here let's see what astrology says regarding this now basically what is cryptocurrency from a astrological perspective it is something that is going to change the way money is going to be handled yes it is going to change the way we we exchange uh, commodities like in the earlier times there was the barter system these days there is something called as money which is a collective belief belief system which everybody abides by yes nobody has said that this 100 dollar is this much this 10 euro is this much but whenever you see 100 euros you always compare it with your indian currency note okay 100 euros is this much money 7500 indian rupees am i right maybe <laughs> but the same thing applies to cryptocurrency also yes that is a uniform way of uh, communication so therefore the first thing is it is related to money and communication all right therefore who is the planet that signifies money and communication yes 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 it is mercury now the second thing is this is not something which is uh, like it industry which means it industry affected the whole world in a very large large scale but this is much 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 bigger than that this is because even if you cannot communicate through laptops you are still communicating right but money is the one thing which runs the entire universe at least the bhuloka so that means when we take cryptocurrency into account we cannot only take rahu into account yes we must take planets like uranus and neptune because they are the outer planets they change sign very slowly they stay in one sign for very very long time even sometimes for decades or more than that two decades three decades yes so they represent the masses yes so that means whenever we have uranus and neptune very 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 strongly related to the artha houses and mercury or the lords of the artha houses and the fifth house and the eighth house why fifth house eighth house fifth house is the house of gambling 
it's not gambling exactly gambling is actually the eighth house because that comes under the sinful habits yes so fifth house cannot contain any sinful habits fifth house is the uh, return uh, which you get but when you get too much obsessed about it that gives you depression yes because a person who is gambling all the time he or she cannot be peaceful because they will be like oh this will happen that will happen and then they will suffer yes so that means fifth house has things to do regarding money and transactions and all the share share bazaar as we say in india share market and all the stocks and all this but eighth house is more of the sudden ups and downs which happens with that money yes so if we have different combinations like the lord of the second house or the lord of the sixth house or the lord of the 10th house or the lord of the 11th house why 11th house because 11th house is the house that represents the current trends of the society where the society is heading the new things which is coming in society those things are represented by the 11th house ekadash yes that's the house and that is also the house of money so what i said i will repeat houses 2 6 10 11 and link with 5th 8th with uranus neptune or the lords of these houses are sitting in very prominent houses with uranus or neptune so let's talk with some examples here suppose you are a aries ascendant all right let's take example of aries and libra because they are contraries right they are direct opposites so for aries who is the second lord second lord is venus yes and 11th lord is saturn and now the 10th lord here is also saturn and the 5th lord is surya yes and who is the 8th lord 8th lord is mangal himself yes the lagna lord for aries that means if venus saturn or sun yes i am not taking the 8th lord into consideration here i am saying the second lord and the 10th and 11th if these three lords for aries which is venus and saturn himself if they are related to sun yes and suppose sun is sitting in the 11th house along with mars along with uranus and neptune then this can be a very powerful combination and along with that you if if you have to see that you can have prolonged income from this then the houses 8 and 11 has to be linked because 8th house represents those things which happen suddenly and 11th house represents gains yes so if you have combinations like 8th lord conjunct 10th lord in the 11th house then this is fabulous because from the 11th they are expecting the 5th house also or if you have combinations like 5th lord conjunct 8th lord in the 10th with uranus neptune or in the 11th house this is fabulous or if you have a combination like your lagna lord is sitting in the 10th or in the 8th or in the 11th with the lords of these houses then what happens is then when the lagnesh gets involved the ascendant lord this does not remain a factor of money alone this becomes like a life path yes the person will invest the person will fail he will gain money then this thing keeps going on yes but the link of the 10th house and the 11th house has to be there the link of the 6th house also has to be there but 6th house is not very important here because 6th house is also the house of job but it uh, money but it's the house of job so if you have 6th lord also associated with this then generally what uh, we have seen is that the, this pursuit becomes like a daily activity because 6th house shows daily activities right which means for a libra ascendant suppose let me give you an example suppose you are a libra ascendant then suppose your moon is in the 11th house in leo so now moon is the 10th lord here so 10th lord is going to the 11th but that doesn't show all this cryptocurrency and all that can show a million other things but if that is having connection with venus because venus is the 8th lord and suppose uranus and neptune are also sitting there all right then this can show very prominent money coming from these sources also if the 8th lord 
alone is sitting in 10th or 11th that can also be a very prominent indication is it understood because 8th house shows sudden money so when 8th lord is sitting in the 10th house and if it is in a good dignity very important if it is in a good dignity then it can give you fabulous results provided it is having link with uranus and neptune and as i said if the lagnesh is involved then this becomes like a life path yes or if suppose you have uranus neptune and 11th lord conjunct 8th lord in the lagna itself then you will be like 24 hours this thing these things will be going on in your mind so these are the different combinations by which you can uh, understand that should you invest there or not because this has a lot of risk so many people have been asking me that oh i have this combination here that combination there should i invest in this how much should i invest yes so what i have decided is in my website i will be putting uh, another option in the services section for this alone because so many requests i have been getting People don't want to know if they will get married. People don't want to know if they will have children. They don't want to know which career they will be. They just want to know if they will become rich using cryptocurrency. Yes. So I will put that option by today. I don't know which number it will come. But if you click the link below in this uh, below the video, which is there, then it will directly take you to the services page. And somewhere in that you can find cryptocurrency yes in that the second option i think will be good because second house is the awesome money right <laughs> so in that i will tell you what are the probable chances that you should invest yes and one thing in general i would say to anybody if it is your hard-earned money please do not invest hard-earned money means if you lose that somehow you will die then please don't invest please 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 do not invest because ultimately nobody knows what will happen right but if you have some money which even if you lose it it will it is not going to affect you in a very big way then you can invest in this and again i am not taking a side here that oh it is good or it is bad i cannot say that and i don't think anybody else in this planet can also say that yes should you invest or should you not invest so these are the uh, conditions by which you can analyze your own chart and that is what I have been thinking that I should put another option should you invest <laughs> in cryptocurrency or not because I have been getting so many requests I have been mind boggled with this no, not with this idea but with the requests which I have been getting for making this video and then will I get money yes and suppose there are different planets like for example only the second lord or the sixth lord is linked yes with the eighth lord and with uranus and neptune then invest very little but if your 10th house and the 11th house the lords of the 10th and 11th are also getting involved with uranus neptune and the eighth house then you can invest big amount you will get in return all right of course that depends on which dasha you are running what transits is happening yes which houses are getting activated yes when uh, this time period is running because sometimes it can happen that there are so many currencies where you invest one person may gain another person may invest in another currency they may uh, lose the money yes so please don't blindly uh, invest in this that's very dangerous but if you feel that whatever i have seen in this video is very strongly there in your chart and you have surplus money which even if you lose in totality from 100 it becomes zero it is not going to affect you then maybe you can try for some days yes so that is uh, my take on cryptocurrency so if you are interested to know as so many of you have been mailing me that this is there that is there should i do this should i not do this then i have uh, i will open the second option in my web page <laughs> i am forced to do that i have no other option i don't know it will be second third fourth or fifth but i'll try that it comes in the second option okay in my website i have to check okay so there you go if you are interested in a consultation then please approach me and if you want me to make any other video on any other topic 
then also let me know and if you have not yet subscribed then maybe after seeing this you will subscribe yes and if you know somebody who is eagerly waiting searching and thinking should they invest or not then direct them to this video all right so that they can also get an understanding of should they be investing at all in cryptocurrency okay and before i begin or i end as i always say god is there with you all the time just look to him when you invest <laughs> okay so if it is your hard earned money do not invest if it is your surplus only then you should invest okay and invest little little keep seeing how the market is fluctuating and by that protect yourself all right because i don't want that you have a bad experience all right and yeah later on nobody should tell me oh my 10th lord was here 11th lord was here it was with uranus neptune this 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 you said like this and i invested my money went down i'm sorry i am not responsible for anything neither am i telling you that you go and invest but because so many of you have been asking me so i have been overwhelmed with these requests and i am like Oof, that's it i have to make the video now <laughs> because i have to give some hint some indication at least yes so these are the points which i have said so accordingly the free will is yours god has given you the free will decide yourself and if you want to take my help then you can take this consultation from me but even then i will just tell you that these these are your chances i am not going to give you a yes or a no answer that should you invest or should you not invest okay so later on nobody can blame me oh i had invested a million dollars nah, oh my god i lost all money it is all because of you i'll sue you no no no, no. i am giving the disclaimer at the end in this video okay i am not responsible for anything that happens okay so ultimate decision is yours so that is it from my side hope you get benefited by this video and if you like this video then share it okay until next time with some other currency <laughs> bye bye see you